Oh, hey everybody, it's Mick here. We got a, a project. Look, here's the project today. I got this here pop-up camper. See, you can tell. And then over here is my little boat. And Big Worm and I were talking, and we are like, man, it sure would be nice if we could tow the little boat behind the camper. So I came up with a hitch. I was going through some scrap and I had a hitch, a bumper mount hitch. And I'm like, sweet, I'll just bump, bolt it right on there. Well, of course nothing ever works that way. See, here's the hitch I got. And I was hoping that I could just attach the, uh, the long arms here right to the bottom side of the bumper and then hit that some more back up under the, the frame or something. But it's not gonna work because on a pop-up, you got this piece that sticks down below the bumper. And uh, yeah, it's not gonna work. Plus the, and to, to get below that, the hitch would just be way too low. So we're fabricating. So here was my, my thoughts, because uh, this is a, you know, it's a small boat. This is a pretty heavy duty bumper for considering. And it's attached in various points, like there and there and there. So there's these couple of spots here well, there's already holes, and there's nothing back there. So I thought, start digging through all my scrap, and I got uh, I got a bunch of angle, like this, a bunch of little pieces, and I got this piece of four inch uh, square stock, or two inch square, whatever the hell it is. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what size this is. Three inch square stock. How about that? So I thought, well, hell, I can make me a couple brackets bolt in here and come straight back and then put that square stock across the top of it and then put the hitch to that. So that's what we're going to try to do. All right, so we're, uh, we're getting a little further with this camper trailer hitch project, I think. So uh, we got our brackets cut here and so far that's what we got. I put the handle in because I want to make sure that our crank handle is going to clear the hitch. I still got to trim this off a little bit, but I'm just going to wait till I get this kind of welded up. But and get the back view. That's going to be the bracket for the hitch. And then I took the little hitch part off of the uh, the bracket or the, the frame mount thing that it was on. And then what we're going to do I think is connect this right here. But now thinking about it, I'm almost having thoughts on just making this so we could put a ball right there. I almost think that would work. I'm gonna have to think. I'm gonna have to think. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and weld this up because I know that's gonna be like that, get that cut off and then we'll think about that idea some more. All right, check it out everybody, the hitch is finished. I shouldn't have uh, backed the trailer up against this rock pile before I decided to take this video, but I kind of forgot about finishing this up. So uh, here's what we did is we just built a, a little bracket that's bolted to the frame of the trailer and it's, uh, I don't know if I stand on it, it's, it don't wibble, wiggle or wobble or anything, so. I think that that will be sufficient enough for hauling that. The only thing I still got left to do is uh, I got to tap into the lights. So I got a wiring harness back here. So we got trailer lights on the boat trailer. But that will be no big deal. So anyway, uh, another project finished. Thanks for watching.